Hey Josh, great job in class. Uh, if you want to show me the acoustic guitar that you just got, I'd love to check it out. We can learn some stuff on that. So if you want to bring that next week, that'd be great. Um, let's do this. What we've been working on was kind of extending this minor and pentatonic scale, right? So instead of just playing this first position, we've... That's as far as we got last week. Now what we're gonna do, this is sort of one little, like we almost think of this as like a run, right? So this is its own little, um, this is its own position. And we're gonna learn a second one, all right? And there, this isn't really all that official, right? Like this is just kind of us, this is what we've been covering in our lessons. So um, there's not like a, um, an official name for these positions. This is just pretty common though, to be able to, um, <laughs> work your way up like this without learning every single position um, of every you know scale. Um, so we can always think of this as like position one, all right? And this is gonna be position two, okay? Don't let my terminology confuse you. I don't know if any of that made sense. Um, if not, then don't worry about it. Just play what I'm showing you right now. Um, again, we're still in A minor, and I'm going 10, 12, 10, 12, so that's on the 6th, 5th, and 3rd. So 10, 12 on the 6th string. Um, 10, 12 on the 5th string. 10, 12 on the 4th string. Rather, I said 3rd. Um, then what we're going to do is we're going to come up. We're going to then slide up to the 14th fret of the 4th string. So, All right. And then we're going to go 12, 14 on the 3rd string. 13... 15 on the second string and then 12 15 on the first string so all together that's uh 10 12 10 12 10 12 uh 12 14 12 14 13 15 13 15 practice that solo with this scale and really start to unlock it and then we'll add that into all the other positions that we've been learning Work on that, let me know if you have any questions, and I'll see you next week.